I just found a new artist who makes amazing music, Master Grady Tate. And look at this cover. The dude used his picture from school. And this album's from 1977. That's old school. I salute you, Master Grady Tate. All right, so I found the part that I want to take from the next song, and I have everything recording behind me. This track is the one I was talking about, and it is just awesome. All right, sweet, that's done recording. All right, I got my loop loaded up into the beat machine. And uh, I threw a couple equalizers on there just to give it a little bit more bass and uh, a little more kick in the drum. You see I'm just boosting the low end and a little bit of the low mids. I threw on this. This is a lift and it just gives a lot of nice uh, low end and high end. Um, it's like a special processor. I'm going to start putting some drums on here now. I'm going to have to play around a little until I can get the groove because there's already some drums in this sample. I have my favorite drum kit loaded up right now and I'm going to start with that. So I now have my drum pattern in there. That one was kind of tough but I matched it up. The drums are a bit subtle, so they really are just like enhancing what's already there. I added um, a quick cymbal that isn't really in the normal sample, so that actually like gave it a lot more life. I pretty much just need like an intro 